editions are coming out for this and I just might have to get it. changing my life. This just got adapted into a movie and it's today and tomorrow. Let us know if you're gonna go see it. These are the books that someone recommended to me during a reading sprint for fairy tale retellings and they're actually really beautiful. five dollars and the same one over here for $7.99. Let's take that one. <laughs> I might get them again. These are gorgeous covers of Harry Potter. Super cute. since we went book shopping. So we just got done shopping at Barnes and Noble and Half Price. We originally just wanted to go to Barnes and Noble, but we didn't find too much there. So we ended up going to Half Price too, since it's right across the street. And we always find great stuff there. Something about it, they're always fully stocked. We love going to the clearance section first to see what they have. We always love going book shopping and just treating ourselves a little bit. <laughs> at Barnes and Noble, I did get one book. I decided to get something that I haven't really seen a lot. I've been reading a lot of popular book talks romance books. I've just kind of wanted to pick something that is still giving cute but it's not talked about a lot. So I got this one. It's called Shipwrecked by Olivia Dade. I just thought this cover is so cute. I love a cartoon cover. It says Maria's one night stands the thick thighed sexy viking of a man she left without a word or a note just reappeared. Apparently Peter is her co-star and they're about to spend the next six years filming on an Irish island together. She still wants him but he wants nothing to do with her. Peter knows this role could finally transform him from a forgettable character actor into a leading man. He also knows a failed relationship with Maria could poison the set and he won't sabotage his career for a woman who's already walked away from him once. I personally love reading about characters who are actors. I think it's so fun. You kind of get like a little insight on how things work. I haven't seen anyone talk about this. I feel like it has everything that could potentially be a really great romance book so I will let you guys know. I didn't get anything at Barnes because I'm trying to save my money but I did get a couple things from the clearance section at half price. This one I actually have I've seen before and it was only two dollars it is when no one is watching by Alyssa cole it's like a cute little mass market size it says sydney green is brooklyn born and raised but her beloved neighborhood seems to change every time she blinks condos are popping up for sale signs are everywhere and the neighbors she's known all her life are disappearing she partners up with her new neighbor and they kind of deep dive into this conspiracy they're trying to figure out what's happening in the neighborhood it is a thriller and i've heard good reviews about this one i like how it's different it's not just like a murder mystery 
mystery like there's actually something happening and they're trying to piece it together the front says it's a compulsive entertaining and thought-provoking novel so i hope so two dollars i mean when stuff is that affordable mm -hmm. i just have to get it the one i found in half price was in the clearance section super random did i need this right now no but when the time comes this will not be in the clearance section so this is the holiday swap by maggie knox this was five dollars you guys and it's a book of the month book mm -hmm. every time we do go to half price books anytime we see the book of the month books for this cheap we have to get them so if you get them from book of the month like an add-on is 10.99 so this for five dollars i already wanted this book anyways hardcover book of the month cover i mean come on when chef charlie gets hit on the head on the la set of her reality baking show she loses her critical ability to taste and smell that is so messed up that's awful that's like her life that's her career meanwhile charlie's identical twin Cass is frantically trying to hold her own life together back in her quaint mountain hometown while running the family's bakery and dealing with a breakup that just won't end with only days until christmas a desperate charlie and Cass do something they haven't done since they were kids switch places i love a good parent trap moment right that is so cute this is typical hallmark movie but i love it i think i've seen this movie on hallmark yeah will the twins identity swap be a recipe for disaster or for getting their lives back on track that sounds cute that sounds so cute i will be reading this one in december the second one i got from half price is called sea of tranquility by emily st john mandel and i've actually heard someone recently recommending this because it's such a unique story so when i saw it there i had to get it i was trying to read the inside and it's very confusing but it has four stars on goodreads and i liked this girl's review so i'm gonna read that instead so it doesn't give away too much it says we start in the year 1912 and travel to a colony on the moon 500 years later it's science fiction fantasy short stories because we're following different characters and there's time travel involved i think just the fact that it spans over 500 years is insane books like that are so intriguing to me it says a story of humanity across centuries in space i mean i think it sounds good i've been buying a lot of short stories recently i think because they're so easy to read but the last time travel book i read when the coffee gets cold i really enjoyed so i'm hoping this kind of gives the same vibes and the cover's gorgeous so that was all the books we got just a quick shopping trip let us know in the comments what your favorite bookstore is to shop at on friday we will be doing a spend a bookish day with us video we really liked the last one we did it was so much fun we think we're just gonna go around do some fun bookish things and take you guys along with us we are officially one week into our book club literal besties so if you have not had a chance to join yet there's still plenty of time to do so and we will leave the link to that in the description along with that we will also link our snapchat we finally made a snapchat account we wanted to make one because we find with instagram we are constantly overthinking our posts and it always stops us from posting we wanted a platform where we can just post more stuff behind the scenes on filming days and just things we do day to day so we will go ahead and leave that link in the description as always make sure to like and subscribe if you haven't already and we will see you next time also the car is on the car is on it's too hot i'm sorry no the texas weather is done with the cool weather it's it's now summer i'm still hot and we're in air condition i like that they oh <laughs> <laughs> i sound like dumbledore um <laughs>